So today we're going to learn how to install new engines inside of Chessbase. So here we are in Chessbase 17 and we only have two engines installed, let's say Fritz 18 or Power Fritz 18 or what have you. And you've decided, you know what, I want to install Stockfish. So we go to the web page of Stockfish here and we see Stockfish 16 open and we can download Stockfish and we do that. And here we have the various options. We decide to right click on it, save link as. You can of course just simply click on the button and we have the option of downloading it, so we do that. Once downloaded, we open up the file. In this case, it's a zip file. And we have it here and we say extract all. Yep, this is what we want to do. Just click on extract. And we're good to go. So here we are back at Chessbase 17. And we're going to open up one of the databases and open up a game or a brand new board. It doesn't really matter which. And here we're going to choose at the very top, at home, create UCI engine. That's what you want. So we click on it and it asks us where we want to choose our engine. So we already have it here. So we're going to click on this button over here and we locate the engine we were looking for. In this particular case, we have downloaded the new Stockfish. So we go to it. And here we have the executable and we click on it once, choose open. And now you can see it already filled out the other information. It says name, Stockfish 16, it recognizes it, author, etc. And you can actually configure it according to the way you want by clicking on parameter. So for here, for example, I can choose threads, skill level, and so on. Let's just leave it as it is. And we click on OK. And that is really all there is. So how do you use it? Well, you have two options. You can add Kibitzer, which is basically open up an engine, which is what we want. And we're going to find out where is our good friend Stockfish. Stockfish 16, there we go. And we can open it up, or suppose we want to make Stockfish 16 our brand new default engine. So we would click on Advanced, and here we would enable Default Engine. So we'll do that, click on OK, click on OK. And here you can see it opens up the engine Stockfish 16. Now, let's suppose I decide to close it. In the future, if I now click on Default Kibitzer, which is basically Alt F2, it will automatically open up Stockfish 16 as my preferred engine. And you can change this as at will. And that, my friend, is the lesson of the day.